Buenos días, mi nombre es Alejandra Barzani, titular técnica de Advanced y Back de Turismo. Bueno, estamos acá en el World of Coca-Cola y estamos haciendo el recorrido. Bueno, recién pasamos por la primera parte, ahora viene la parte que es un show. All right, ladies and gentlemen, well, welcome to The Loft. This room has over 100 years of history, and they span across over 30 different countries, and they are in over 24 different languages. You guys can now ooh and ah to your liking. Ooh, ah. So if you guys picture taking and videotaping, strongly encouraged in this room, because this is the first and last time you'll be in here. So, I need you all to know that Coca-Cola is much more than just a sugary, bubbly beverage. Oh, no, 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 no. As I said before, Coca-Cola is the largest and oldest beverage company in the entire world. We have over 500 brands of beverages around the world and thousands of flavors to date and still creating some to this day. And every single artifact in this room is a depiction of how long we've been around and how strong we are as a company. So every time guests come in this room, what I like to do is play a little game of I Spy with them just to see how well they can identify artifacts from across Coca-Cola's history. Does that sound like fun? Yeah. Yeah, all right, so this is how the game is going to work. I'm going to point out a couple artifacts in the room to you all. However, all I'm allowed to tell you about these artifacts is the year that they are from and their location in the room. You guys have to guess it based off of that. So what we're gonna do is start with the oldest and the most expensive artifact in this entire room. Now this artifact comes to us from 1896, so it's 125 years old. And if you guys just keep an artifact of such age in this room, where would you put it? take a closer look or if you want to just scan the glass cases you are free to do so and then I'm going to take two guesses so starting now 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 time check all right raise your hand if you have a guess raise your hand yes what do you think buddy ah this porcelain coca-cola super dispenser that's a good guess that's a good guess anyone else have a guess the box yeah. collectively. All right, this is a wooden Coca-Cola cooler. All right, so we got our two guesses. We have the dispenser and we have the cooler. Can we get a drum roll, please? <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the answer is the porcelain syrup dispenser. actually one of the only remaining ones in the entire world, and this is the one in the best condition. Now, before Coca-Cola distributed their products via cans and bottles, they distributed via glass cups. And you can see one of those glass cups right there at the bottom. So when we opened our doors in 1886, we only sold Coca-Cola for five cents a cup, just a nickel. And in that cup, you would receive one ounce of Coca-Cola syrup mixed with about five ounces of carbonated water. And then you would have yourself a nice, Refreshing. Six ounce glass of lukewarm Coca Cola! Yeah, room temperature. Because ice was a luxury item back then, a lot of people could not afford, so they had to drink the Coca Cola lukewarm. Hands up if you like lukewarm Coca Cola. Good. Good. <laughs> All right, now the price of Coca Cola stayed five cents for 70 years, and then in 1956, we were actually forced to raise our prices to the whopping, unconventional, unheard of. Six cents a cup, just a piece. And people were actually outraged about Highway Robert threatening to sue. But 135 years later, here we are, still selling Coca-Cola. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I want you to turn your attention to the back wall. Everyone, turn your attention to the back wall. Now, I want you guys to see if you can identify a sign or a poster up there that is 102 years old. It was made in 1919. A sign or a post. I'm gonna give you 10 seconds and I'll take my two guesses. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And time's up. All right, raise your hand. If you have a guess, raise your hand. Yes, buddy, what you thinking? The blue one? All right, that's our first guess. Anyone else have a guess? Yes, ma'am. Who meant? 
The one in the, the one in the corner? All right, can I get a drum roll, please? that building and the Spencerian script that you all know and love has actually been the same for over a hundred years and it was popularized by the accountant of Coca-Cola, Asa Briggs. We have never changed that and we have popularized it and named it after him. So ladies and gentlemen, I know you saw those lights flashing in a couple of seconds or as of right now, these doors are going to open. You guys will be escorted to the theater. We do ask that you save the back two rows for stroller and wheelchair families. Have a great rest of your day. I promise I'm done following you. <laughs> bueno, seguimos en un próximo video.